So let's talk about the Arizona real estate residential market right now. It is hot, hot, hot. <laughs> it is hot, hot, hot. Um, so uh, before we went into the pandemic, pre-pandemic, we were already short inventory, meaning there weren't enough homes out there for people who wanted to purchase. Right. So that was before we went in. Um, we were already in what they call a seller's market. And that had been almost a year because we had actually technically been in a real estate recession up until March of 2019. And we came out of it like crazy in March of 2019. And so we'd moved into this and then the pandemic hit and everyone's like, oh, we're stuck at home with these people that we liked, but we liked them from six at night till 10 at night. We don't like them from six at night till six at night the next day. So like we need more space, you know, and, and now they're like, oh, there's these kids that we're homeschooling and they need like a desk and a place. We can't just throw them on the couch with an iPad and expect them to learn something. So everyone's like, we need more space. Um, and a lot of people who bought those uh, condos because it was, you know, get rid of everything and downsize was like, ooh, yeah, we made a downsize a little too much. So we already had, you know, a shortage in homes for sale and a surplus of buyers. And the pandemic really created the space where um, the majority of homes in um, Maricopa County in Arizona um, under uh, 400, 450,000 are going up on the market. Um, they're selling the first weekend and they have anywhere between 10 and 18 um, offers on them. So it's definitely um, a very competitive um, market, but it's it's also fun. You know, if you understand the home buying process and you're working with the right people, um, it can be fun and it can really feel like a win um, when you move into your new home. 